in this video, we are going to continue helping this noob reach third C using the Awakened Revamp String Food. One more thing, guys, we've reached 300,000 subscribers. Thank you, guys, from the bottom of my heart. Again, this channel is nothing without you all. Where the actor slam. Oh, they're yes. dancing forward. There's your slam. There's the dunk. Hello. Gamer Nom is back. And we are back in the first C. So why are we in the first C? Because guys, grinding here is the best option. With the Raiders in the second C, they're so far apart. With the Mercenaries, less experience per quest. And it's very easy to server hop Cyborg in the first C. But don't worry, I will give you options on where to grind later. But first, guys, again, revamped String Fruit C skill is now auto aim. Check this out. The cursor is here, but it is attacking the enemy on the right side of the screen. Which is really good, right? One more if you haven't noticed it. There you go. Our goal here is to reach level 750. Okay, next up, back to the second C. Again, Gamer Nom, why not the mercenary quest? I'm gonna show it to you. The experience that you will get is 9 million. Okay, almost 10 M. For the cyborg, it's 10 million. So I prefer server hop and not luring enemies, okay? But we're gonna focus here with the diamond. At 750, you will unlock the quest. It's located here. But guys, I won't suggest Diamond. Especially if you're in the public server because it's near the cafe. It's always dead. There are lots of max level players here. They will bully you. So just avoid it, okay? But again, in the end, it's your choice. Well, I'm just gonna give you a tip on how to grind the mercenaries, okay? So from here in the port, in the starting area, you're just gonna go to the right. Oh, but you need... Uh, shards here are fragments or you just can buy gun in the first C Depends on you what gun there you go. So buy the kabucha here And then you can farm the mercenaries faster, right? Okay, so this is my way of farming. There you go Okay, so let's focus on the levels now our goal is to reach level 775 and after that moving on to swan pirates So first lure them with your kabucha here one two three and four there you go line them up use your z skill use your x skill and your v skill okay and that's it you're gonna do this twice to level up your goal level here is is to reach level 850 and after that we are moving on to our next target a mini boss in this area jeremy again think twice because this is near the cafe jeremy is located here there you go so to defeat him just use your skills Dodge to the side, there you go, use your skills, dodge to the side, and that's it. Suggest you grind here if there are no max level bullies in the area, or you can just focus with the mercenaries. The goal here is 900 or 925. Why gamer no? Why or? Because the next mob here, the marine captain, is really hard to defeat for some people, so if you can defeat them, go for it. I'm gonna show it to you, just lure 5, first 5. There you go, use your gun, dodge dodge, use your observation hockey, there you go, X skill and V skill, that's it. If this is easy for you, go here, but if you're having a hard time, go with a Bersenari or Jeremy, okay? So the goal here is to reach level 925, and after that, you can start defeating Fajita. Okay, so the mini boss in the green zone is located here. Gamer Nom, can you give us some tips? So you're gonna use, obviously you're gonna use all your skills, right? After that, create some distance. He will cast his skills, make sure your observation is turned on, and there you go. You won't get hit, okay? Our target level here is level 950, and after that, we can now move on to our next grinding island, the Graveyard Island. So here, we're gonna start and end with the zombies. Again, we're gonna use our kabucha to lure the enemies. See that? There's one, two, three, and four. Guys, you need to, lure, uh, to defeat eight to finish the quest. So there you go. Just lure four, V skill, and one, Z skill. You're just gonna repeat this until you reach level 1000. Next up, the snow mountains. Guys, you're gonna grind here for a long time. The goal here is to reach level 1,150 and you're just gonna grind the snow troopers. So how do you grind them? Lure 4 here and that's it. Again, we're gonna use a gun, Z skill, V skill or you can use your X skill before V skill. So it really depends on you. You can experiment. There you go. Again, the goal here is to reach level 1,150. 
Okay, so next up, the hot and cold island. We're gonna go straight to defeat the easiest boss to defeat in this map. The Smoke Admiral he is located here. And again, the best way to defeat him, just lure him outside. Wait, let me show it to you. There you go. And after he's killed, go out, go inside. Okay, and there you go. You'll get stalked. And it's an easy kill. For me guys, go level here is 1250, but I'll give you a choice. So guys, here as you can see, my level is 1268. You can still level up here until 1300, but guys, you can go to the cursed ship and start defeating the ship deckhand at level 1250 again. Okay, so here we go. How to defeat them? The slur again, the kabucha or any gun. One, two, three, and four. Four, okay, use your Z skill or your V skill, and that's it, guys. Very easy to burst them. 1300 is your target level. Next up, ship stewards. So, first, you're gonna lure four. One, two, three, and four. So, defeat them, right? Then, the remaining one, defeat it until your V skill cooldowns, okay? So, after that, lure three, and that's it. So, the goal here is to reach level 1350, and after that, Ice Castle. So from here on, everything will be a lot faster. We're gonna start with the Arctic Warriors. So you need to defeat eight. Just door four here. One, two, three, and four. Just like when you're doing Zumba. Okay, you're gonna use your Z, X, and V skill. Goal here is to reach level 1,400. Next up, the Ice Admiral. Again at 1,400. So easy to defeat. V skill here. There you go. X and C. Hide on top. Z skill, there you go, as you can see. You can maximize your C skill here because, again, it's auto-aim. So even though you're not pointing on your enemy, see that? It's still being damaged, okay? So what's your goal here? Your goal level here is to reach level 1,475. And after that, final grinding island, the forgotten island. But we're only going to grind one mob here, and that is the Tide Keeper. This mob is kinda annoying once he summons his sea king or sea beast, but overall it is easy to defeat, okay? So don't worry about that. Your goal here is to reach level 1500, and once you reach that level, you will get a quest. Same with the first tier, right? You will be having the Coliseum quest, but make sure to finish the Bartholium quest and beat Swan. Those are also requirements. After that, go here, you will talk to King Redhead, there you go. You will fight someone and after that, you can now go to the green zone. Look for the master. Is it a master captain? Uh, the Mr. Captain, sorry, master. And then he will send you to the third C, guys. Finally, and that's proof, here is our third C badge. Okay, guys, so I think that's it for this video. Again, to so all the viewers, subscribers, supporters, I really appreciate you all. This is Gamer Gnome, and Gamer Gnome out.